Uh, hey there, eh? Uh, I'm Trent, and I'm here to talk about the high cost of post-secondary education. Post-secondary education can uh, influence your life, and it's associated with physical and mental health. When I was in high school, my teachers, they told me that if I work hard, I could do anything. I can have a career that I want, I can make money, have a house, or a car, or whatever. So, I decided to enroll in school, but then I found out my dreams are going to cost money. The average cost of post-secondary education in Canada is almost $20,000 a year. This includes tuition, rent, food, and other expenses. 47% of families cannot afford to send their children to school, which means that these people must rely on student loans and work after-school jobs to pay their bills. Despite this hard work, two in five students struggle with food insecurity, and this rate is even higher in Aboriginal and racialized people. While in school, these students are stressed out and distracted from their coursework, which ultimately impacts their grades. Higher education is supposed to be empowering, give you more confidence, and open up more opportunities. However, future me will graduate with $25,000 plus debt, and according to the Canadian Student Loan Program, it will take me at least 10 years to pay that student loan back. Post-secondary education is our road to social justice. It equalizes the distribution of wealth, opportunities, and privileges. So access to education should be fair for all Canadians, and we shouldn't have to fight for education based on our income level. To fix the problem, I propose that education grants be easily available to all Canadians and not loans.